I still love you and I can't stop thinking about you. The sun could be dealing with the Leo. You could have a uh, child. Be mother and child. This could be a feminine energy. Still loving somebody or feel still feels love for somebody. Can't stop thinking about somebody. I still love you. Can't stop thinking about you. You could have a child with this person. Seven of Wands reversed. Somebody needs to put their pride aside. Give up, surrender. Give up the fight and surrender. Um, you could be thinking about your baby mama or somebody you're partnered up with or you have kids or a child with or children. Whoever this is, you're seeing this person in a totally new light. This is somebody that's bringing that peaceful energy. This person, this is somebody that's going to keep shining no matter what. You could have been trying to tear this person's confidence down or somebody you were dealing with was trying to tear your confidence down or to destroy your confidence, see you um, trying to defeat you, trying to get you to back down, trying to get you to fall. You're continuing to shine, shining your light. You're staying in that positive, loving energy. You're embracing your power. You're embracing your joy. You're embracing your peace. Somebody's just like, okay, you win. This is what I'm getting. Okay, you win. Because uh, somebody's giving up the fight, surrendering, because they know they need to just surrender and work with their divine counterpart or their soulmate. Or whoever this is you're teaming up with or some friend or some soul, somebody a part of your soul, a soul tribe. Still love you, and I can't stop thinking about you. This person could have cheated on you or deceived you in some way, shape, or form. Could have lied to you or about you to other people. This person was trying to get away with something. Could have been trying to get away with having to give to you equally or share something with you or share their money with you. If this is a co-parenting situation or you guys are parents or share children together. Could be dealing with a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person knows that they have to just give the fuck up. Whatever they keep trying to get you to fall and, and knock you down and create uh, barriers for you and blockages for you. This person knows they need to just put the bullshit aside because you're in this, this sun energy. Everything is light and uh, beautiful on your end, on your side of the street. This person looks like they've been trying to manipulate their way to avoid something or avoid you. This person was trying to attack you, it looks like, or trying to one-up you, trying to uh, plot against you with other people or the community, your circle, your all's friends. You're somebody very beautiful. This is, you're very, you're very like, this is very, this is, it goes back to that piece. She's got a white dress on. You're somebody very pure. Um, very angelic, very divine. Other people could look at you like um, you're vibrating in some sort of innocent energy. Somebody was trying to fuck with your mind, okay, or make you look crazy, make you look like you were mentally unstable, like something was wrong with you, like you had issues. This person was spreading a lot of jealous. This person was spreading a lot of rumors about you. This person could have been jealous of you in the past. Now this person knows that they're going to have to team up with you and cooperate with something. Some type of cooperation is here. Let me get some water, you guys. I'm out of breath. I think that's pretty uh, obvious. So let me get to the next energy. They could be working on improving their financial situation um, or increasing their income. They're trying to work on their own personal self-worth, their own personal value, self-worth, self-value. I'm having sleepless nights over divine masculine or divine feminine or both. They were giving me both earlier. Somebody's having sleepless nights over um, divine masculine and divine feminine energy, a karmics, karmic situation. Give me 
Yeah, Nine of Swords. Thank you, Spirit. Nine of Swords. You're not sleeping well. Not at all. Having dark thoughts, paranoid. Somebody having sleepless nights, please. Yeah, they're stuck in some heartbreak energy at the moment. Same way they were trying to have you guys. The same way they were trying to have you all feeling and stuff. That's how they're feeling. I think that's called karma is what it looks like to me. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Two of swords. Because they were trying to blindfold you to the truth. These people didn't want you to see that they were the ones with mental issues. Okay. Mental disturbances. They're dealing with their own trauma. They didn't want you to see some sort of truth. They didn't want, yeah, Queen of Swords reversed. They didn't want you to see that they're unstable, mentally unstable. They've got unre they've got uh, repressed trauma. You're detaching though. You've you've uh, you're freeing yourself. These people were just stabbing you in your back, hurting you, trying to walk all over and pin you down in life. Having sleepless nights over Divine Masculine or Divine Feminine. You're releasing fears. You're embracing your personal power. You will be surprised. Some of you guys are dealing with somebody that keeps harassing you every day or keeps uh, harassing you. Right now, somebody's working on building a better future for you, them, and uh, your guys' kids or your guys' children. Spirit is asking you to learn to let go, go with the flow for the blessings to show up. This is what you've done. This energy can't let go and just be. Somebody's coming back home or returning home. So somebody's um, could be repairing your guys' family dynamic or coming back home. This is this energy is um, somebody that's been harassing somebody. Okay. Show me this energy, please. Somebody keeps harassing somebody. Your person could have been trying to make you feel like you were harassing them or you were a threat to them or you were some sort of danger to them when it's really this energy right here. The star reversed. Yeah, this person is just pure negativity. This person is holding on to some sort of grudge, some sort of resentments. Keeps harassing me. Someone keeps harassing somebody. Four of Wands. This person could be trying to start trouble in your home or create fights or something. Or come in between your family, your family dynamic, or somebody you have a family with. Because I see a home coming here. Four of Wands or a reunion coming back home. Somebody wants you to focus on the negative. They want to destroy your dreams. They want to make you think your dreams can't come true or you can't have happiness or peace in your life. This is somebody that's uh, very miserable trying to bring you down. Yeah, this person is somebody that's not making no changes. This is somebody very egotistical. This person is somebody that doesn't care about you, your needs. This is, um, yeah, this person is harassing somebody. It could be every day for some of you guys harassing you or your person every day. Running from some sort of truth. Yeah, your person could have made you feel like and told other people you were the one that was crazy. You were harassing them or you were bullying them or something like that of that nature. Okay, your person could have made other people think that um, somebody was cussing somebody out. Somebody tried to make your person, whoever this is, try to make the public or people look at you like you were crazy, like you were loud and obnoxious, like you were some sort of criminal or you were some sort of danger or something like that. Or you were some sort of liar or something like that. Whatever this energy is here that's having sleepless nights over you or your person or both of y'all guys, this is actually this person's identity. This person was trying to project their energy off onto y'all guys. Two, four wands. Yeah, this is somebody that is harassing or bullying somebody every day and trying to act like they're not. Yeah, trying to hold and cling on to somebody. These people were trying, somebody was trying to confuse you or keep you in some type of illusion. 
somebody's being harassed by somebody that they've been in denial about or not speaking up or not sitting their foot down or speaking out about it. Some broken relationship or some tension between two people. Okay, show me um, someone coming back home soon or returning home or some homecoming, please. Some of you guys are married to this person. Magician reverse. Yeah, you're getting ready to come back home to somebody or go back home to somebody or someone's coming back home to you, returning home. And somebody's been trying to manipulate the situation. Somebody just needs to accept that and accept that's what's actually going on and stop letting somebody manipulate them or trick them or put on some sort of illusion or some dark magic. Somebody's trying to take your person away from you. They want to feel like they have the upper hand or they have some sort of control. Somebody wants to take from you some karmic, whoever's having sleepless nights, 